Hey, quick video today, guys. I bought a bunch of ring terminals from a whole bunch of different manufacturers, and I'm gonna test the internal resistance to see if it even really matters. Um, let's get started. We have SES battery terminals. We have a bag of install gear. These are all four gauge. Um, we have a Sanuke multi-pack. We have a Zipchi multi-pack. This one is unbranded, but it is a TSI NG Lax uh, multi pack. We have a cheaper install gear multi pack. Cell term. Unbranded. I'll have to look up where these came from. And TK DMR, which is pretty highly rated on Amazon and one of the most advertised. So we're going to test all of these and figure out the internal resistance of all of them, and if it even matters. I'm gonna start with the install here. We're going to measure from the very inside lip of the exterior so like right here to the inner part of the ring curl where the wire would be correct. Okay, so here I have 0 0.06 milliohms on the first install gear. Now I'm going to use the second install here, which is the golden ring lugs. Uh -huh. Same thing from the very inside of this right here. Oh wow, look at that difference. That's huge. So this is the other type of install gear, and this is a quarter milliohm for just the ring terminal in resistance from the outer point of the lip to uh, it's 0.24 now, but the inside. So already, I mean, that's a that's four times more resistance between just the two install gear. Okay, so next I have the SES battery lug. This one's also reading at 0 0.06, and it is, it is kind of deeper. And one of the things to note about this one is it's much shorter. So, I mean, that could help in the long run, really, in making sure that you know, you're using the wire and just getting it all the way in there. Um, so that was 0 0.06. So that's tied for the best. The other one we had was 0 0.06 of the install gear. Next we have the, the Singalax, I think it was. Um, so from inner lip here to so this one looks to be about 0 0.07. Next, we have the Zipchi. This one is also point zero seven. <clears throat> Next, we have the cell term, which is one of the most heavily advertised as a nice flare entry here. Um, go ahead and test this one. And this we are at 0 0.06.
Next, we have the TKMDR, which is like the name brand, I suppose, on Amazon. Um, point zero six. Next we have the Sanuke, which we got in one of the multi-packs. It looks very similar to the other ones. So this one is reading as 0 .05 for the Sanuke. So that is the best so far. And then finally we have the last one of the generics that didn't even have like a brand written on it. Um, let me get this tested. We're showing 0 0.09. So while most of these were pretty close, I'm going to say the main takeaway here is ring terminals that look like this one, like from the cheap install gear pack, are really bad. They're thinner than the others. Um, so, you know, we're talking about, you know, every single connection, every time you have to do one of these lugs, you're adding this much resistance. Uh, maybe not as much because you're filling up to here in the lug, but I mean, just be aware this is not insignificant and this will add up over time. I mean, 0 0.06, not not so much 0 0.05. I mean, this, like if you have a 0 0.09 or even, you know, God forbid, this 0.24 milliohms per, per ring is just completely unacceptable. That's, that's for sure. Um, that's almost as much as some battery cells in just the lug terminal for the wire connection. Avoid these at all costs. Um, so I'll go ahead and graph all these out. I'll try to gather some prices, figure out, you know, for the value, what's the, what's the best vibe. I promise you it's not going to be this stuff. So here we have it all graphed out, and as you can see, uh, they're relatively close in price. Uh, the ones that are higher, like the Siglax, the Zipchi, uh, those are multi-packs, so they may actually be a better deal, but I just took the price and figured out how many actual four-gauge lugs I got out of that multi-pack. Um, so it's actually a little bit of a better deal than that, but overall, if it really matters, um, I would go with the Sanuke. It's it's definitely not the most expensive, and it did show um, a hundredth of a milliohm lower impedance than any of the other ones. So um, I would say the most important thing here is just to avoid the type this, that we saw with the install gear, like the the cheap looking flimsy round rings for the four gauge, um, avoid at all costs. They were actually more expensive than the other install gear type that had a much better uh, impedance than it did. So really it's not going to matter too much um, as long as you avoid that specific type. Uh, if you have any questions, just let me know. Uh, we'll be making more videos soon.